was able to, you know, get some open looks. And um, like you said, they didn't have that big shot blocker in the middle, so I was able to get to the rim <laughs> and, uh, and make some shots. It, it was, the offense was getting a little stagnant, I guess. Uh, I mean, is that yeah. coach telling you take over or you kind of realize yeah. I'm, I'm the one that's got to do this because I can beat Nash off the dribble? Or? Just pick and rolls. You know, we were getting good looks off pick and rolls all night long. Um, you know, we saw some matchups that we could take advantage of and be able to get, you know, one shot to go, two shots to go, and then, you know, kind of get into a rhythm and, you know, plays work and, you know, just kind of go with it. You got them for a minute. Do you look at try to figure this team out? I mean, because this is a game everybody thought you don't have a chance. Yeah, but, you know, it's funny in that way that it is. We've had games like that, you know, early in the season. We've been on Oklahoma City without Josh, and we went, you know, we have some other games where we're shorthanded and we win. So I think this team is very resilient, and we look at challenges like this, and, you know, we accept them for long. You hit back-to-back -back step backs on Nash. Did you see him overstepping and you knew you'd get him, or was that just kind of you start Just reading the situation and, you know, trying to attack him the best that I could. Look, 